Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to our review of the Xbox One November update. You know what that brings? That brings custom backgrounds. One of the big things I would love to see in my Xbox is finally here and it's pretty easy to actually do that now. So once you have the update or you're the preview program like me, uh, you go into your media player and then from here you go to the folder where you have your images saved. In my case, it's a USB flash drive and I can go ahead and go into the images and select an image. So you have to actually view the image images in full before selecting them. So I have a couple of images here, about five in total, and I have all these images on my Pinterest anime board. So go to Border Work on uh, Pinterest anime board, and you can download any of these images that you see right here. Now, one thing is you cannot use a GIF uh, or a GIF. Uh, so I'm gonna try to use that a GIF image, and um, once you hit the menu button, it brings up the option to set uh, background. It will tell you, no, you can't. You must use a PNG or JPEG file. So sorry, it'd be cool if I could actually save this, and hopefully that's an update for that in the future uh, but you know I'm gonna you know I'll, I'll use the Cowboy Bebop uh, background here so menu set as background head back to home and you should see this as your background takes about a uh, half a second and you can see it there so it shows up now it depends on how your image is or where it's placed in your background so you can see most of it just because your tiles are going to cover it so I'll uh, try another one and uh, let's go ahead and check out uh, this uh, anime city land landscape or sky rise skyline sorry and uh head back home you can see it's changed but then again like i said the images it depends on what kind of image you have so i think i'm going to revert to mikasa from attack on titan the very massive one this one i think this will work out pretty well and uh, we should have our wallpaper so besides this way there's another way of actually changing your wallpaper you look at and it looks great i love this and hopefully we'll see syncing in the future so if you go into your xbox settings menu and you go to my xbox on the left you can now change also not just the wallpaper but the colors so you can change the background colors to any of these different colors that you choose or you want or you can actually go ahead and change the uh, background again to have specific backgrounds so you can have colors specific colors or you can go into images uh, saved images just like we did or achievement art so basically unlocked achievement artwork that you've uh, unlocked during gameplay you can use so whatever games you've played the achievement artworks have been unlocked you can see all the different games the other many percentages and things like that so you can actually jump in and so i'm going to jump into titanfall and uh, i'll use one of the images from titanfall there to actually use for my background now you can see a bunch of images that i've already unlocked i can go ahead and scroll through and look through them but it's nice so it means that you can have a plethora of backgrounds and microsoft's already walked this in there so you know you don't always have to have that usb uh flash drive and or, or go into your media player but you can actually just you know have uh, wallpapers from your achievements so i'm going to use halfway there and once you click on it you go into the, the image you can just go ahead and set it as a home background and it's a very easy process so you can do that uh head back home and it should be your background have a second change there you go and that's it so that's how you set the backgrounds now the other thing that's also added to this is you can actually now tweet out your favorite game clips it's a very simple process the ability to now share your gameplay clips via twitter which is nice you know i always have to do the upload studio and uh, things like that but you know easiest easy way to do it. so you have a bunch of clips you want to tweet out a couple out there you go to upload studio and then you select the clip you want um and basically either go into it or hit the press the menu button for options and go to share once you go into share you have the ability now to see it says twitter and basically you can share it add a caption so you can hashtag it all the way you want tag people in there and you can tweet it out but i'm just going to tag this xbox one uh madden touchdown and you can check my twitter feed it's up there plus another one from forza horizon so it's nice that you can easily tweet out whatever you want uh gameplay wise uh, off your xbox one especially also just combining some of the other things within this update with the uh custom background so that's that's nice and you hit share and you are good share it to twitter so that's it now besides that there are other updates there uh to this um november update so you do have the ability to actually check out friends activities on on your um xbox one smart class you also now have a live t 
uh, TV mini guide that also includes uh, Twitter uh, in there. And you can also check search games for gold on your Xbox One smart class. So that's also nice. You have to update the smart class, of course, as well as update uh, your uh, application on um, your Xbox One. But overall, it's a solid update. I want to see more, especially the backgrounds. I want to see it sync with your PC. Most likely that might come with Windows 10, but I like it. So if you guys have any questions or any comments, let me know. Otherwise, don't forget to like this video, share this video, favorite this video, subscribe to the channel, and always enjoy your entertainment.